What's happening, everybody? Hey, welcome, yo. welcome back to more Dragon Quest. Yes. Uh, let me check the shit. Sorry if I'm like kind of quieter than normal. I just spent like seven hours at a fucking amusement park. I'm so physically tired. You know, you had a you had a big day today. I did. You know, with uh, hanging out with our friend uh, Chaos. You've probably seen them in chat. Actually, I think we we called her by her name. Yeah, chat, Brie. Right? Yeah. Well, Anywho, uh, welcome back everybody, how's it going? Uh, we're here after our very long stream last time. Mm. We did all the side, well it's not even side, you have to do it. Um, but now... We did the side stories. As a good old, good old Blue, Blue John told us, that we should head up the Emerald Coast and head to the last bastion. So we're headed that way. What's a bastion? Uh, a Speaking. bastion in this scenario, like a stronghold. Oh, okay. So King Sparrow then? No. Oh. Up south of Heliodor. The oh. Kingsborough was that like tomb that like the orb was in. Remember, oh, yeah, know? that's right. That's right. There. Anyway, uh, that's wrong. Well, no horse. Hey, Yoshi hasn't gone. Fuck your horse. Horse is gone. Friends are gone. I'm gonna try to avoid too many fights when it's just us for her right now because fucking yeah figured I thought that was one beast those red and yellow guys oh they yeah were not. also this fucking guy he's kind of cute though dusk would ride that in battle hmm yeah she has a hanging bud what's going on oh. doing alright how are you eh, not bad not bad a little overheated but not anything terrible so we're in here at night tomorrow. Watch your step; it could get slippery. A peculiar cow. We go ahead the right way. Up to the last bastion. Some last bastion. But first, add an antidotal herb. Thinking about making more food, but I already ate something today. The struggles of being wide. <laughs> Fair enough. I mean, most people should be eating three times a day. Yeah, if you're hungry, bud, you gotta eat something. Minimum. If it makes you feel any better, all I've had today is a mini pumpkin muffin. I had some ice cream. And then I got McDonald's on the way home from the amusement park. Hmm. I'm trying to have some, uh... This place. Zero sugar Gatorade. This place is seeing better days. It's so salty. It means I'm so dehydrated. Or, uh, so sweet, rather. It means I'm dehydrated. This, uh, this place is in rough shape. Banui. You know, we got tough versions of basically all these enemies. Mm. And again, I would like to not have to deal with this if I can. That's fair. I don't think most of these enemies are too tough, but if we end up fighting, you know, more than a few of them in one encounter, that's going to be rough, especially because we don't have healing spells anymore. Yeah, exactly. Mean Bert, what's up, bud? Run. Does this place look familiar? Yes. You know, this is where we, like, learned how to save, basically. Mm, at the and that very guy... Beginning. Pepper, stop trying to climb the window. Do you need to like shut that so she doesn't like tear She's through fine. the fucking thing? She's fine. She's playing with a bug. Okay. Alright. Uh, down. Always. That way. Oops, sorry. Yeah, yeah I'm fine. Alright. I'm sorry there's not much for me to say, especially because I am intentionally avoiding fucking combat, but... So, are we getting Silvando first? What do you mean? Well, we need our party members. Uh, I can't really answer that. If you're asking if, the, if, you're asking if the Final Fantasy VI comparison goes as deep as we get to pick who we get first, no, we do not. Okay. That, that's just my go-to comparison for 
the world was fine, the world is fucked, and it's basically a new map. Yeah. Might as well quick mill stuff today. Decent, decent. Anything good? I honestly don't know the last time we went shopping. I should probably go soon. Because we're almost out of milk. Me. Yeah. There it is, Bab. Now, if you remember what this map used to look like, there should be something here. Emerald Coast that way, Mango Grove over there. Isn't that where we started? Yeah, yeah, this is roughly where Cobblestone should have been, I think. The dog! Sandy survived! Put it down. Its eyes are weird, don't give me that. Let's go. Yeah, we don't need to follow the dog, but... <sighs> Quiet for like an hour outside and as soon as we want to stream, jackasses fucking blaring music. Ramen, cans of soup, pasta, pears, ketchup, mustard, being have sad hot dogs is sad, also five-finger discount on some Neo. <laughs> Fair enough. I mean, hey dude, fucking... Ramen, soup, and pasta, what else do you need? Sandy, there you are. And where did you run off to, might I ask? <gasps> oh my, it's, it's Goddamn really kettle, you, fair isn't enough. it? You're alive, and you, you, you've come back to us. Oh, I've been so, so, so worried, especially after... Well, we heard such awful things. <laughs> I wish they did more, Jello. Yeah. Oh, Sandy, you're right, of course. This is the best news I could have hoped for. And here I am, blubbering like a no baby. No cuddle in this house pouring boiling, boiling water into ramen cups with a saucepan is not childhood experience I would enjoy redoing. Welcome home. That's rough. That is rough, buddy. It's not quite the cobblestone we grew up in, is it? No. We've been through a lot. After you left, this terrible man named Jasper came. I'll never forget his eyes. They were so cold. I'm an expert at a childhood training for this. He rounded us all up in the center of the village, and then he ordered his men to kill us. But we were lucky. Not everyone is as cruel as Jasper. No, another soldier came and told him to stop. He said there was no need to take our lives. But that didn't stop them burning the village to the ground and locking us all up in the castle. Still, yes, that's that what happened to everybody when they raised cobblestone in that dorm. No so our next person is going to be uh, Hendrix. Then you're assuming Hendrix alive. He is. Sorry, Sandy. You're right. He literally he looked over his shoulder. He just got home after a long journey. He doesn't want to hear me blathering. Lots on. of dudes have shoulders. Most dudes have shoulders. Come on, let's go and see the one person who'll be even happier to see you than me. gonna see our mum. Hopefully. Now hopefully she's still alive. The world kind of ended. Shoulders men rise up. It's all collarbones from here on. Everyone has shoulders dipshit. It came free with your fucking birth. Hi <laughs> <I> Dusk. <laughs> everyone, has sh everyone has shoulders dipshit is an insane sentence. Yeah. Come on girls. Put your backs into it. The boys are out there doing the fighting, so it's up to us to keep the home fires burning. Sorry to interrupt, Amber, but uh, I've got big news. Hello, Gemma. Love. Pizza, hell yeah. What's nice. got you so excited? Hmm? Well, I have the oldest birth in the world. I don't have shoulders. <laughs> <laughs> There's someone I very think. special here to see you. 
My little soldier. Oh. Kind of nice how they're not one and done characters. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, very easily could have just never saw her mom again, and no one would have blinked. You know what yeah. I mean? After all like the awful things that happened, I was sure you. Were... Sure you were. When the disaster struck, so many people lost their lives. <laughs> the sun vanished, <laughs> you and those terrible monsters appeared part. all over the That's place. That's insane. Even those of us who were lucky enough to survive were so drained and desperate that we almost lost the will to live. And then the hero appeared just when we needed him. He did all he could to help people, no matter who they were or where they were from. He fought off the monsters and brought everyone here to safety. Without him, I dread to think what would have become of us. And now, thanks to him, the place you once knew as Cobblestone has become the last bastion. Humanity's safe haven in a world beset by darkness. Would you believe we've even got the King of Heliodor camped out here? Uh-oh. Well, you'll remember, Mortigan jumped out of him before no, everything went down. I guess, yeah. Like, he's not still sure Mortigan. M Mortigan's hanging out in his fucking sky castle seem. laughing at us. He may be the last person you want to see, but you should go and talk things through with the king. Your grandfather would have wanted you to at least try. Yeah, I think Just our real grandfather would have wanted us to beat the man with a stick. Love. For me, it's the one in the middle of the camp with the two flags. And be polite. Fine, Mom. I'll be nice to the old cunt. For now. For now. Uh, Royal tent. In the middle of the two flags, she says. So it's like up to the left. No, up. Ah. And then to the left. Yep, yep. Just like me doing a scamper on Parasite Royal End. Yeah, yeah, that was a terrible fucking mod pack. I thought this horse was in a cage. For a second. Thanks, Mom, I've been trying. And don't threaten to eat him, dear. I promised only try. <laughs> ah, this way. There we go. I have this issue with games, and you guys have seen me do it a thousand times in so many games, where if there's a map, I will laser focus on the mini-map and not where I'm running. So I'll, I'll unironically be like, I'm almost there. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm not doing a bit. Like, I literally just tunnel vision on the map. I think, I think I can blame that on a childhood of playing a lot of DS games. Mm. Where, like, the map is on a completely separate screen, so I just fucking zoom in, you know? Greetings, Mr. Luminary Sir. His Majesty is waiting for you inside. You're welcome not long ago. He seems rather keen to talk to you. Mmm. Hey, buddy. So, you are alive and well, I see. Nice throw, you have loser. nothing to fear. I have regained my senses at last. The living nightmare that began for me on the day of your birth has ended. Though in truth, I remember little of what I did. I have inflicted so much pain on so many. On you. I do not ask for forgiveness. I do not deserve it. All I ask Aww. is that I be Poor allowed to atone. Because, I mean, it really wasn't his fault. He was literally being possessed by the devil made. from the Bible. Like... Yeah. Tell me. Do you recall what happened on that fateful day? The events that came to pass beneath Yggdrasil's branches? It was like six hours of gameplay ago, but yeah, I think I got it mostly. What if you say I no? Oh. I recall... Nothing. All I know is that whomever or I appreciate him like had me in its grasp being like I literally years, don't even remember what I did, I just me. know it was bad. Yeah. yeah, like I woke up and everything was on fire. Like and when at long last I returned to my senses. I was here. There is something else I must ask you. Tell me. Do you know 
if my daughter is alive. I see. Your Majesty, the hero has returned. He brings more survivors seeking sanctuary. Come. You must meet he to whom we owe our survival. Though you may not wish to at first. You know, Your Highness, people might be a bit more keen on you if you stop speaking in cryptic fucking old man language. But I love being cryptic. Like, north of the entrance. So, this way. Yeah, yeah, literally, just to give her on fire. Like, because he didn't know. Yeah. He doesn't remember. He just woke up and everything was awful. Like, that would be worse than having context, I think. Yeah. Because we at least know what happened, right? We're like, well, that was fucked. Welcome back, Hendrik. Well, what news? The forces of darkness amass at the gates of Heliodor. They will strike, and soon. Sire, the people must be removed to safety. Men! All the signs are that our enemy will strike tonight. Oh, we had great to timing, arms. apparently. Awesome. They shall not find us unprepared! As you see, he is as eloquent as ever. But you must forgive him. He has fought harder than any of us. He has sacrificed more than anyone. Which is why his burden must be lightened. It is time that your differences were set aside, Luminary. Mankind needs you. Hendrik needs you. Will you stand beside him? I mean, the game is gonna make us, I think, so... We don't exactly have a lot of other friends to turn to at the moment. The assault tonight, we may yet survive. Join the I've got a spot on my hand missing a mark that says otherwise, yeah. Which is smart, because we had it when we were a fish. Alright, so we gotta get ready to fight. Which means I gotta go uh, have a word with God. As you leap off an edge? You know, just in case. Save me, Jesus. Just put that there to make you feel better. Yeah, I guess. Alright, well, are you ready? Yeah. Alright, fuck it, let's go. Hendrik said that they're massing at the gates. Uh, yeah, that's not my passion. There we go. Oh, sorry. You good? newest recruit. They say you made it all the way to the last bastion under your own steam. Well, I'm impressed, I've got to tell you. You can obviously handle yourself there, or you were born lucky. Well, either way, I'm sure we can find a use for you. Follow me. Right. Here's your spot. Just face that way, and when the monsters come, stick the pointy end of your sword in them. <laughs> oh, don't look so worried. You'll be fine. Simple enough. <laughs> At least this dude's in a good mood. Yeah. Hi, Hendrik. What naturally? They didn't let you keep your edgy unicorn armor for your horse? Is this the same horse? 
Probably. Enemy forces! Here they come! This man will die in the next four hours. You know, from the monsters are buying me. The best plan you got. There's the type of instruction I want to get if I choose experienced in RPGs. <laughs> yeah, that's fair, isn't it? He's like, have you played one of these before? Yep. All right, have fun. Really going for human wave tactics, huh? Low bit. Listen, man, we got sharp metal, we got horses. What else do we need? Is there a Dragon Quest Warriors game? Like a Hyrule Warriors-esque, like, Dynasty Warriors clone with Dragon Quest characters? Because I would play that. This is new? Is this new? Yeah, no, we do do some fighting. Um... Oh, actually, no, we do keep our healing. Okay, we actually... No, most of our spells actually aren't even from the Luminary Tree. Never fucking mind. Die, ghoul. It's called Dragon Quest Heroes, and there's two of them. Oh, okay. Are they any good? Yeah, look at this falcon blade of ours, uh... Still doing pretty good. Mm. Yeah, no, it's not all cutscene. We gotta help out our fellow man. Luckily, these guys are pretty distracted trying to, you know, kill our fellow man. Yeah. It's pretty fun, they bring back old characters 3D to it and even make some bug characters canon. Oh, that's neat. See, that's why I like having a shield. Meanwhile, me waiting for Dragon Quest Builders 3. <laughs> Too stunned to move. Do you still count as a dragon? Gonna go yes. Dragon Quest V, there's a priest who is combat focused because he always goes for thwack and heroes his supers and spamming thwack until it works because a personality trait is not a bug. <laughs> Damn. That is so good, actually. You know what? That's really funny. I'm not a fan of the whole, like, you can't control your party members shtick from, like, old Dragon Quest games. You know, that's kind of part of the reason I never got into these games. Like, I've tried playing them, like, on, like, emulators back in the day. But, like, that's really funny. I like that a lot. I like leaning into that for a bit. And not even for a bit, I guess. Like, you're literally just saying, no, that's just real. That's just how this guy is. Mm. These are my straw got stuck in my teeth. I'm not having great tooth luck lately. Real nuke Gandhi thing going on there, yeah. Do I go, like, get a floss pick or something, or...? No. Okay. You, you good? No. up real quick. Got a rock bomb shard. Word. I took care of all the little guys. Um, supposed to do X spell that does more damage to Y type of enemy, but X is, but if X is thwack, it only targets for success. Thwack always wins with that logic. That's so bad. God damn. Yeah, yeah. This camera's insane. 
of all the slimes. Bree with the resub. I made it home, by the way. Awesome. Yay. Thank you, my friend. Appreciate it. Is this new? Yeah, it's like you'll lose a gamble if you don't think. Let's go gambling! Thou art without a shred of guile. And the other would have fled the field long ago. But I have no complaints. I kind of fuck with this idea for a design for a for a Oh dang log. it. Oh dang it. Oh dang it. Oh dang it. Oh dang it. I kind of fuck with this idea for a dual Han design. Mm. Like incorporating the severed head into like the armor. It's like a part of a shield. Yeah. Three. Hello. Five gifted. What the fuck? Thank you. Holy shit. What about Mr. Josh's butt? Oh, oh that's what you meant by you'll get me later. God damn it, Bree. Thank you. Nice. Thank you. Appreciate you. Oh, thanks, Kaios. You're going cute today. Jaywall bot is crazy. Aw, David got one. Let's go. Appreciate you, bud. The headless honcho and his henchmen are here. So that's less than good. Good, I'm glad you got one, Yosh. Um. Well, we still have Boom. Luckily, none of these side enemies have too much health as we saw. And we have Hendrik here to help. Back above, That's which stuttered. increases our defense. That's what? It stuttered. Man, sure would be great if we had some form of electricity magic. Yeah, right, imagine. But we took out like most of those guys immediately, so. Yeah, the luminary shit's only like our electric attacks, so we're not doing too bad. I'm gonna. No, oh, no, my magical might. Actually, it's just a regular attack. He hit twice. He's made a metal. Get his ass. I don't think that works that way. Now I'm going to bed. Night, night. Good night, Bree. Night. Thanks again. Appreciate you. Dang it, does this work? Hey, not really. Oh! Hendrick also has healing, which is nice. Come on. Alright, nice. We There's the flute, do it again. Metal Slash should just be ooey gooey metallic boy slash. Yeah, pretty much. Nebulas is leading. Retreat! Move your bones! Commander, a message from His Majesty. He wishes to speak with you. Both of you. Hmm. Right away. Well, we did it. Yeah. I don't see any of our. I don't see any dead versions of our dudes hanging around. You need to keep attacking after your leader goes down. You need to weaken them. You know we we did pretty good. The headless honcho took no took no lives. Dead guys don't hang around usually. Yeah, yeah. Wee. 
I miss Rab's gay little run. Yeah, me too. Sorry, I'm still, like, really fucking tired. No, you're good. This might not be a full-length stream, unfortunately, boys, but... I really like spinny rides. Yeah, Salem. <laughs> yeah, so... Part of the reason Salem uh, went with, you know, Bree instead of me is, uh, I, I fucking hate amusement parks and shit, dude. Like, I cannot stand it. For, for Jameson, amusement parks are a sensory nightmare. For me, they're a sensory escape because I get to spin in screen. Yeah, I don't like that much heat and people and noise and blah, blah, blah. The heat was awful, don't get me wrong, but everything else was awesome. Like, frankly, if we streamed yesterday, I probably would have just said, fuck it, we don't bother tonight, <laughs> but... You have proven your strength and your ability to work together. It is time. Time to bring light back to this benighted land. The fiend that usurped my throne must be ousted. Heliodor Castle must be reclaimed. And you, my loyal servants, must lead the charge. But, but sire. I do not give these orders lightly, Hendrik. My spies have found a means by which we might gain an advantage. The city sewers can I like how he seems just as uneasy the at the moment the as we do. Which yeah, yeah. Stands. You will use these sewers well, you gotta to think about it, right? the castle from beneath. Hend like, Carnelian here has the excuse of he didn't know what was going on, hmm. right? He doesn't remember. He just assumed he did batch in. He's right. Hendrik basically had orders to kill Moses, if we want to keep that joke going, and just ran with it. Benighted can mean pitiful or can literally mean covered in darkness. Huh. This key will unlock the gate. Hooray! Yay! Sewer key! I love but poop keys. Who will command our forces in my absence? If the enemy renews the attack, we will be slaughtered. We will not. We will be prepared. Prepared to draw them out, leaving the castle unguarded. The usurper must be overthrown while we have the chance. We strike now, or we never see the light of day again. Please, your majesty. We cannot allow yet more lives to be lost. Precisely. Which is why you must quell the darkness at its source. We seize our one opportunity, or we consign ourselves to despair. It is as simple as that. <coughs> or do you question the wisdom of your king? My subjects have shown me the depth of their courage. I trust in their ability to endure this one last assault. And I order you to do likewise. <gasps> what kind of noise was that? <gasps> hope. Do not let us down. The first the first grunt was a realization of like, alright, fine, the second grunt was God my knees. After an all too brief rest, the time comes for Pixel to set out the Heliodor. We should play Fortune Street at some point. Mm. And through the Mangle Grove to the Heliodor and Foothills. Well, if you say so, game. Let's leave. If you say so, Book God. I guess that cow did warn us. 
Yeah. I wonder if cows predicting the weather is just like a like a joke in Dragon Quest, or if this game is just fucking weird. Well, there's a farmer's myth that cows, when they lay down, means it's gonna rain. Is that not true? Is it not it's like? It's based off of the pressure. Right. Let's... Oh. Mr. Hendrick, sir, I couldn't have a quick word with my boy, could I? I won't be long. Wait a I minute. Promise. She just called him love. She's talking to as us. As long as it is quick. Well, this is just this game. Cows usually usually got cow pies so and milk and dragon quest. Yeah, fair enough. Are you? No, he, she, she's talking to us. Hendrick is not putting it to our just mother. I was sure just like, hello? Hendrick and do as you're told. God, can and you imagine? You dare go giving up ever. Just look at me, eh? Something's wrong with my eyes now, too. Must be all this squinting in the dark. Well... Only one remedy for that. You'll just have to bring back the light. Promise? We love Amber, we do. She is so cute. Time is short. We must be on our way. Do we you get to look use this force? My boy, won't you, Sir Hendrick? Um, I don't remember, actually. Hmm. Obsidian, see the lady back to safety. I guess not. Also, incredibly edgy name for a horse, but it does keep up, like, the name theming, which I appreciate. Mm. Even though Hendrick himself doesn't really do that. Yeah. No worry about your mother. The king has vowed to protect her and the people of the encampment, and he's a man of his word. When you enter the castle, find a source of the darkness. There's a church on the hill beneath Heliodor. We'll bash ourselves there while we search for the entrance to the sewers. All right. Weird how it just kind of warped us here. I mean, yeah. Yeah, I'll take it. So we can buy some shit from this little short man here. Um, yeah, a better shield might be worth it. Better armor. Yeah, well, I'm gonna grab the armor. There we go. Nope. There he is. Hello. Come on, Hendrick. We must be off. To the sewers. I can't jump off that cliff. The, the fucking inconsistency of what cliffs I can jump off of, I swear. Yeah. At this point in the game, I called Hendrick a crazy bitch for thinking he was allowed to use a greatsword as well and forced him on addicts. <laughs> yeah, that's fair, honestly. Mushrooms. The mushrooms are angry. Mushrooms are angry. They're so cute. Unfortunately, Hendrick is still doing his own thing. Actually, pretty good. I'm, yeah, I'm sure. I didn't really get 60 points in. Meanwhile, I went, oh boy, two great swords. <laughs> we'll we'll get into that when when we can. Which will hopefully be soon. We also got some completely new enemies. These things. Word. Honestly. They're just they're just called flamethrowers. I like them. Holy fuck. I have a baby. Please be careful about her. <laughs> I'm not... Take Let me rephrase that. Please don't put her too close to the mic because she's not careful with the mic because she's a dumb animal. Me when they say how spicy do you want this? <laughs> oh, shit. Firewood and special medicine. Decent. Maybe we should be killing these guys more. Shiny thing! Cotton top. She's not even trying to get out, she's just hanging out. Mm. Up we go, boys. Not that I give the cats many struggle snuggles. Which is... No, they usually pepper. Pepper doesn't really like to be held. Yeah, but she's kind of chilling at the moment. Mm. 
It makes because she's like, I think she likes watching the TV. Pretty good for her record. Yeah. Pepper really does not like being picked up and like handled. I think that might be because the only time I really do it is when I'm trying to get her like off of shit she's not supposed to be on. I think it's because when she was a kitten, she was wasn't really handled till she was older. That's it. There's a lot of griffins in so, that castle. The assault begins. I assume they're coming from the castle. Move. This is no time for idling. This is gonna be so bad. What do you mean? Bro, it's fucking Luminary and Hendrick. Bros for life. We got this. Bros for life, huh? Bros for life. Uh-huh. Luminary and Hendrick. Thousand years, Luminary and Hendrick. Through the poop shoot. Through the poop shoot with your boys. You don't just travel through a poop shoot with a man and come out the other side as anything less than brothers. Right, Hendrick? Hendrick? Yeah. There he is. <laughs> 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 oh, that was beautiful. He's like, I absolutely do not agree. Back in the sewers. This is where we met Hendrick, if you'll recall. Be nice to Hendrick, he's your shield bottom. <laughs> what the fuck? He wasn't acknowledging that so hard he phased out of reality. Mm. Nice. He got infernal armor and vicious bubble slime. What vicious bubble tea tastes like? Spicy. Not the spicy tea. It would be like spicy chai. No, if we had Dava, dude, if we had Dava, we'd be done with this section already. Now, if only we Dava. No, if only we, if only we were Dava from the start of the game. None of this would have happened. We can use the sewer key to open up these doors. And what do we find? A fat load of nothing. Oh, see, strength is pretty good. They're just throwing us all the way to the top of that castle. Yeah, 100%. So I should also point out, um, I mentioned earlier there is, like, an opportune time to use your seeds. Because mm -hmm. those are just stat-ups and I have not used them yet. Are you smart enough to remember to use your seeds? Um, basically now, any time is good. I'm not using them quite yet. Um, but basically, I would just recommend not bothering to use them in Act 1. On God, I left this man for so long enough, long enough to grow a tree. Yeah, like Sam, when I first played this, because I just, I forget to bother a lot of the time with items like that in RPGs, you know? Mercedes looks very bad. There we go. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, bats. Fuck. Not the vicious Drakis. Word. Good job, Andrew. Earthbound Syndrome of this is the only one of these you get. Use it wisely. I won't use it, then fuck you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See? I meant to hit the button to let me pull up the healing, and I hit every button except for that one. Nice. I see, my thing is, I think it's like, I think mine is less Earthbound Syndrome and more Pokemon, because you get, like, the vitamins in Pokemon that, like, give you, like, extra EVs and shit, but they only give you, like, ten, and it's single-player Pokemon, so you don't need them, so I always just sell them. Yeah. Like, I never bother using, like, proteins and calciums and shit in Pokemon, like, pretty much ever. Um... I think that's where my habit comes from, of not bothering. Because they're really not... Because 10 EVs is not a lot. For me, whenever I forget items like that, it's because... Uh, I forget what it's called, but it's like... If you don't see something, it's not there. 
Oh, like just the fucking um, like object permanence, like yes. just, it out of sight, out of mind completely. Yeah, I tend to do that. Yeah, no, that's fair. That's so fair. Oh, Roy's crew is in here. <laughs> <laughs> Jameson. Mini metal. I'm gonna mini metal your fucking. Those are cute rats. They are very cute. If we go in this room, we will find not much. Is there another seed in here? Mm, perfect pan p panacea. Still want to make the mini metals real with geocaching? Do it. I can do it. You know how hype someone will be? Even if they don't know what it is. You know, if they just find a little gold star metal, like under a rock somewhere, like, I'll be hype. Yeah. Holy shit. Okay, Pixel. Fucking simmer the fuck down. It was a single fucking slime. Oh boy. What? I don't, I don't like it when they call for more enemies. It's an onion. Unfortunately, we do not have any pep powers with our boy Hendrick yet. There it is. Well, decent. The masculine urge to order Uber Eats instead of walk across the street at McDonald's is crazy real. <laughs> dude, I could not. I could not be trusted with Uber Eats, dude. We don't have any of that shit around here. And it's probably for the best. Like, like, genuinely. Uh-oh. Nope. I meant kill the birds! I think the three heels. I think I got sunburn just on my lips. How does that happen? I don't know. <laughs> I, mean, I guess you wouldn't be applying sunscreen to your mouth, but... I didn't put on sunscreen at all. I'm very surprised I'm not fucking lobster. How the, why would you not put on sunscreen I at forgot. all? I forgot. Salem, for fuck's sake. Stop kissing the sun, sun kisser. See sun kisser. Boys, opinions on sun kiss. I kiss sun. Because you're a boy, get it? You're a son. Thanks. Sweetie. Ah! Boy's opinion on sun kiss. Mid. Like the, the orange soda. I don't like fruity soda. Except for when I do like fruity soda. It's very weird. <sighs> um. Do you want to be more specific with that or like. I'm more like water flavoring and soda water than I do orange soda. I feel like it's way too artificial tasting. Fair enough. Whereas Neo tastes more like the real thing. Fair enough, I suppose. Grape soda's gross. I think it's pretty good orange soda. I like that. I, like, I like Sprite, like lemon lime. Yeah. Um, I like orange sunkissed over orange crush, but I miss Canadian crush flavors like crush cream soda. Um, I, I feel crush. like I would choose orange crush over sunkiss. I don't think I've had crush. One of them I think is Coke, and the other one's by Pepsi or something. Oh, I see. It's funny that soda is just like that. How it's two mega corps that just hold the soda industry. It's always it's literally like none of them have any like original fucking like as soon as one of them is like oh we made this flavor it's like well we did the same thing. Fuck you. I mean they haven't really made Dr Pepper. No. For Sprite. That's because I don't know if you really I don't know if the Dr Pepper people even know it's in Dr Pepper anymore. Dr Pepper's so good. I would do a lot of slutty things for a Dr. Pepper. Okay. 
here I and here I am just fucking buying it for you. Like what the fuck? Yeah, and do I do slutty things? Salem. So shut your mouth. Salem, we are. We, you need to stop talking like that on camera, please. It's so funny. We're about to get him to back to sleep. Okay. Of course we are. Doctor Pepper is just cola, but hiding behind another name. It's got more depth to it. It definitely got more like. I was a gonna say, spice aromatic type thing going on. It's definitely got more of a unique flavor profile going on, I feel like. like I definitely taste the cola part, but... Uh, yeah, there we go. That's good. Better. I'm glad I didn't buy the fucking helmet. Um, there we go. Away we go. <gasps> the Ku Klux Klan! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's not good. Horse manure. Awesome. In a jar? Yep. Gotta keep it safe. Two jars, one horse. Yeah. <laughs> God, you're so right. <laughs> we can rest in this. Don't place. worry. Neither of you... What does our skin color have to do with this? The Ku Klux Klan! Jameson. What do you think the... What do you think the Ku Klux Klan did? Well, no, I thought he meant the two horse, one jar. Or one horse, two jar. Fuck. <laughs> too many jars. Not enough horses. Too many jars. <laughs> not enough horses. I'm tired. I'm sorry. I only have so much juice left in me, man. I've only got so many horses left. Well, we head this way. Around the scary robed men. Up we go. We're in the castle. He's polishing the floors. They deserve a raise. Yeah, yeah, right. Like this place is in pretty good shape, all things considered. There's a little bit of fire. A few not, a few a little bit of broken furniture, but nothing too bad. Not yet. No, yeah. Wait until we're done with it. Platinum sword. See, like, it is stronger, but our, our and better charm. But our falcon blade hits twice still. That's the thing. I don't think charm fucking matters for us at all. Let's do called the devils in the details. We can make a demon's bane, demon spears, demon whips, and devil tails. That's probably the only recipe book in there. Show the hell door. Tell me against first king of Zordos and his retinue. As you know, I know if I use how to travel, a great black dragon heard the news and deciding this would be a perfect opportunity to slay the King of Zardos, launched a blazing assault on the city. Uh, since the Heliodor flew into panic, a lone knight stood before them with his arm outstretched, doing all he could to protect them from the foul wizard's wrath. So he greatly moves the King of Zardos by the knight's selfish bravery, he presented him with a fine shield in the shape of a great black dragon's scale. To this day, that fabulous treasure will be found in Heliodor. The king may choose to present it to any knight he is worthy of the honor and responsibility the royal represents, first knight of the realm. So that's getting given to Hendrick at some point, or us. I think he's almost completely walking through and picks going back at the words, Ye dundestrayed secrets of ye heart on the faded threadbare cover. Tries to read a page or two, but something tells him he's not quite ready yet. Well, that's ominous, eh, Hendrick? Anyone leave our underwear in here? Damn. You just yelled at me to not be slutty on fucking Twitch. You're talking about being a slut for Dr. Pepper. Yeah. And? Are you saying you wouldn't be a slut for Dr. Pepper? I am 100% saying that, because Dr. Pepper's not expensive. You're wrong. I buy the fucking syrup for the fucking soda stream. I know exactly what the damn Dr. Pepper costs. Dr. Beebus. Hello. That's my final statement on the matter. Oh. Uh-oh. Cutscene. Even the great stairway lies in ruins. I'm not drinking solely Mountain Dew. My stomach can't handle solely Mountain Dew. The usurper will be in the throne room if he is anywhere. He must be found and punished, which means we must seek another way up. This feels very Zelda dungeon to me. It's probably because this kind of looks like the fucked up Hyrule Castle in Breath of the Wild. Yeah. 
Um, no, I love Mountain Dew. Mountain Dew does not love me. It's gotta be said. And as I'll say in the matter, however, look. Touch the Yigi Silk Root? Yes. Touch the root, boy. Come, Jasper. Do your worst. He sounds cooler as a kid. <laughs> Curse you, Hendrick. Root strength wins the day again. <laughs> it is good to see two young men with such spirit. Huh? Is it for getting a lot of Act Two or a lot of this is new? I, I couldn't tell you. I you to cease your horseplay and greet our latest arrival. I present Princess Jade. Oh. Hmm. Okay, so Carnelian was an old fucker older. even when, like, Jade was a baby. Mm. Like, goddamn, dude, the fucking, the, the fucking you. royal scepter shines and even late in life, huh? Like, damn. So I mean, he could probably afford, mm -hmm. uh... Like, magic Viagra or whatever Viagra, they have in this world. that's what I was thinking. Pile drive the baby to this lake. It's 9 p.m. and a legal time to go to the gas station. Is, a, is 9 p.m. and a legal time to go to the gas station for snacks? No, it's like prime time. You would surely be the greatest knights this kingdom has ever seen. Long may we protect the princess and all her people. Huh? <sighs> That's Jasper, scary. are you listening to me? What is this? Why, the shield of Heliodor, of course. Symbol of the kingdom's greatest knights. His majesty keeps it in his private chambers. Hmm, outside scary. No, that's the time where rats skirt day, and squeak. One of us will yeah, bear they. It. I would very much like I to I want see a freezer it. pizza, so what I made breach containment. Do it. I say do it. <laughs> and how do you propose to do that? One cannot simply stroll into the king's chambers uninvited. Oh, I have my ways. I just so happen to spy a certain someone treating himself to a midnight feast in the kitchens. Huh? None other than his royal majesty. He slithered out of a secret passage behind a cupboard and set about the leftovers. That passage must lead to his chambers. Oh, to have a secret tunnel directly <laughs> to the leftovers from You've your bedroom. The right. Of his bulging belly. The queen will make you an earl for such a service to the kingdom. We meet in the kitchen at midnight. Yeah, at nighttime midnight. when the sun falls deep and the streets run sound like to watch the raft drift races sliding from gutter to gutter. Agreed. Yoshi, Yoshi, you usually think you're insane, but I just believe you. <laughs> of course. Passage to the king's chambers. But what was that? A vision? A dream? So this is your power, Luminary? Y you are able to draw on the memories amassed within the world tree? To pry into others' pasts. Very impressive. The kitchen is on the north side of the castle, beyond the banqueting hall. I guess this also explains why people are still, like, alive. Because obviously, you know, Yggdrasil burned and fell, but... Yeah, but then there's also a root, so that means it's not really dead. Yeah, not in great shape, for sure. All things seen better days. Who Lord knows, but... North of the... You at all curious what's going on here? Mm. No? Okay. I'm assuming it's an enemy. I mean, yes, but like... Very distinct enemy. Okay. 
Hmm. Except pop like an ass. Is that giving up? You guys are gonna get up to get not nah, it's fine, it's fine. She's mm -hmm. dead. I appreciate one thing I do appreciate about this game is that like you don't have to find maps of the dungeons you just have a map yeah well didn't you also live here at one or no no I mean Henrik would have so. well yeah but like some games like like I get in like Zelda like it's just tradition and shit but at some point it's like just let me see the fucking map please you know where it gets murdered for going outside let's go I, you got this bud I believe in you Guess her wobble slightly when you touch it. Try moving it. Yeah. I did not make it here that night, you know. I was caught trying to slip out of my chambers. The king made me polish all the armor in the castle. Jasper was disgusted with me. We had a furious argument. We had so many in those days. But there was more happiness than strife. Life was simple. We had a purpose. We would have stood together in defense of Heliodor no matter what. Oh my god, they were brothers in arms. Oh my god, they were roommates. I have treated you poorly. Forgive me. Loyalties have been tested, but not by you. Whatever lies ahead, we must face it together. Will you stand beside me? Hmm. He bows to your exact height, yeah. I like Hendrick. I've played a lot of RPGs, so I've seen a lot of the asshole and or bad guy becomes a party member in my day. Yeah. There's ways to do it very poorly, but I think... I think Hendrix is Hendrix is pretty good. Uh, let's see. Got a recipe book called the Recipe Book of Regal Regalia. We can make king axes, king's coats, queen's robes. That all sounds very expensive. Massive, boring-looking book here entitled "Proceedings of the 36th Annual Conference of Heliodorian Development." Pixel heaves it down, takes a closer look. The margin filled with mouthwatering drawings of cakes and tarts. Each play picture accompanied by detailed notes describing the fabulous flavors of these delectable desserts. And then just describing what a strawberry mousse is. The king is a very one-track-minded man. Love that for him. I love that. Hendrix son. Uh, ah. Another recipe book. A little lifesavers. We can make cure rings, rings of riddance, rings of immunity, rings of truth, ring full moon rings, and arousing rings, and rings of clarity, and sorcerer's rings, and sorcerer's stones. On that uh, <sighs> fireplace, there was a taco. Yeah, but he just blipped out reality. Oh. Pixel learned how to make cock rings. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. We got marquees mittens. Whatever the fuck that means. Mm. What's that way? Your muck. Okay, hold on. Let's just let's go to the throne room before I get distracted. Oh, there's a chest. Yeah, this is probably fine. Just... <laughs> no, no, sage is actually awesome. Run. I love how they just sort of show up. Eh. You know, the tacos that are off-white color are just background observers. Yeah. Yeah, they're just there. It is cute. Sorry, my phone. I don't know what it was. Discord noted. <laughs> the full moon persona. Ah. Uh. You have done well to make it here, old friend. And with the dark spawn in tow, no less. Oh, bravo. Jasper. Temper, temper. 
brute force may have won the day once upon a time, but things are very different now. Why? Why did you give yourself to the darkness? What of our pact? We swore fealty to Heliodor. We promised to protect the kingdom, together! Why? You, of all people, ask me why? <laughs> Does something amuse you, traitor? It is I who must ask you why, surely. I I'd like to point out, I'm decently sure Jasper isn't a vampire. He's just dramatic. Why like this. is it yeah. that you always thought yourself so much I have a feeling he's like me. possessed or some shit with his outfit and everything. No, I'm pretty sure Jasper's just a dick. Why was it always you who was given the golden opportunities? Why was it always you who got just what you wanted? Jasper's a theater can let him be. Hold on, let me catch up on chat. Hold on. I, I, before we get into the dramatic moment, I saw Drew came in. Started a Nuzlocke Infinite Fusion Link with Waffle with starters Totoros, Solosis, and minus Average Totoros. I mean, you both already won. You're fine. Jasper's become the gimmick puppet. Yeah, you know, he's just a theater kid. Like, he's just like this. I'm going why? to explode. He's just purple. Jasper's Tell just a theater why? kid. Jasper sounds like a bit of a bitch. A little bit. But it's nice to at least see the motivation for why he's evil. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's more than a lot of games. A lot of games will be like, they're evil just because, ooh. Right. His character design's really cool. I don't hate the super dramatic design. It's just, it's funny because the last time we saw him, he was just in armor. Yeah. Although I kind of wish we had more time to learn well, about no this before more. fighting him, but... It wasn't really a ton of time. No yeah. Longer. Because they wanted to be I a twist anyway, now. you know? It's not really Love. a twist, but... The, it was a twist that he was Friendship betraying the king and, like, the kingdom. Because we thought he was on, like, the same level as, you know, the Hendrick. All that matters is power. And the only power that matters is that of the darkness. Is he cool? That's how it was. This first generic drink was gets told that it is almost, it is always, it always is destroys and twists well. Yeah, who for sure. My At least from the who one example I have. Power I crave, and all who stand in his way must be destroyed. My hometown, my family, my friends, all to the dark power that you serve. I lost my faith, my purpose. Though some called me hero, I believed I was a fraud and that I was powerless to protect them. But I can protect them. I must. And there is one I must protect above all others. It is the Luminary's duty to deliver the world from evil. And it is my duty to protect him. A voice actor is fucking good for fucking Henry. Jasper, mm. you are a traitor to your kingdom, a servant of evil, and a threat to the servant of light. I sentence you to death! <laughs> really, old friend? Forgive me if I do not begin quaking just yet. Now, let us end this farce. Hendrick grew on me really fast. He might be my favorite character in the end. Mm, that's completely fair. Like, he's just extremely loyal through and through. <laughs> he was always just trying to do what he thought was right. Kazuya Mishima. No longer, Hendrick. This time, it is I who have been chosen. And you 
who will fade into obscurity. <laughs> Jasper. <laughs> I like how we're looking up and smiling and he's looking down and sad. We're, we're not smiling, we're kind of just like, uh, um. There was just a dead guy behind that chair this whole time. Hey, yo. I feel like I'm on my third. Damn, that's crazy. And Jasper just keeps talking. No, we're not fighting. Yeah, no. He, he okay, off. then that makes me feel a little better. I feel like Dusk fucking loves this character. What, Ty Tyrion? I don't really know if I'd call him a character. This design does kind of fuck. He sounds like us. The fucking skeleton man from the new... Screw you, He-Man! Skeletor? Yeah. He exists. Who invited a Skeletor? I want to go demon boobs in typical Roy fashion, but they're not nice enough. Fair enough. Now, that sure is a skeleton doing a skeleton voice, yeah. Eternal night awaits. <laughs> They've got two swords. And so very, like it's fun. And they're yeah. very big fucking swords too. Victory will be ours. Why do skeleton voices sound nasal when they have no noses? That is such a good question. I don't know. There's all the worms up in there. Ugh. So I don't really have much to say in terms of strategy because there's one of us and... Well, there's two of us, but the other one we can't control, so... Yeah. Just do your best. Hope that Hendrik decides to buff you and heal you appropriately. He's using the orb. And now there's another one. Can you guess which one's the real one? Yeah, it's not that Hendrik kind of, can't. Yeah, it's not that kind of a boss fight. Lights. Skeletons are typically pretty warm ones, though. Ugh. You also got a point. It smells like McDonald's. Oh, you're fine. Ew. A lot of holes to let the wind whistle, and it sounds nasally, I'd imagine. Yeah, yeah. That McDonald's been there last night because of power now we couldn't reheat our chili. Damn. No chili -less. Can I ask you how much better the air fryer is? You're eating nuggies. Yeah, that, that sounds about right. We had an air fryer, but that thing was a bitch to fucking clean. Yeah. Air frying McNuggets is amazing. <laughs> I think I should prefer it over again, unfortunately, now. It's fair enough. It crisps up so beautifully. Uh, I, I can imagine it's probably a decent amount better. Yeah. Air frying any cold fried food is good. Behind me! I apparently did not recognize this path. I went on a million times literally this past winter. You, are you lost, Roy? Not lost, just stupid! Okay. Roy! My poor boy! Weren't you getting frozen pizza? Yeah, he's, he's lost. Roy, touch the moss. It's leading north, I swear. That's not true! <laughs> Quick missile, you have to catch the Roy. Moss will grow wherever the fuck it wants. Roy, get lost in the infinite forest. Oh my god. Oh! Luminary! 
Let's, let's just Roy talk. needs a nose pass. I do not. I do not. North is a social construct. It's socially constructed north. Don't let this get it. What the fuck does that even mean? <laughs> it's a social construct. It points to society. My pass is long. Vegetables are a social construct. That that one is. No. This is why I call Hedrick a bottom. Will I follow the wee star? It'll head you. It'll lead you swarth. I love vegetables. Me too. This is why I call Hendrick a bottom. Because he's a tank. Okay. What the fuck does that mean? I tank in World of Warcraft, but I ain't a bottom. Not all tanks are bottoms. Hendrick, Hendrick is ready to take all incoming attacks. Yeah, okay, bottom. Follow your heart, it'll lead you anywhere you throw it. Mm. Yes, they are. Y'all are full of shit. Be the master of your own destiny. <laughs> Poor Roy's just gonna get lost forever. Yeah, the shadow buffs the main one, and that's not good. So this is what Roy needs to do. He needs to find a stick and throw it in whatever way it's pointing to follow the stick. I think Roy knows where he's going, like... <laughs> and he's just taking him longer than he thought it would. Right, things get rough. Eat any of the mushrooms you find. They're all good for you. Think of Mario. Just start shoving mushrooms in your mouth. He is out of MP. God damn it. There's a fountain. I'm gonna drink it. Down device. Chase the stick, Roy. Chase the stick. <laughs> yes. Vegetable is apparently a culinary term. All vegetables can be categorized into parts of a plant, such as tomatoes and fruit, peppers and fruit, therefore salsa, fruit salad. Mm. I choose to believe Roy got Minecraft lost and now has to remember where his face is before sunset. Mm. I thought he was out of mana. That doesn't cause mana. So gay. No, I'm spell. gay, I can say that. Roy, have you tried pressing F3 or typing slash home? Roy, go into creative. Spawn in a pizza. Roy, follow the rats, for they lead the leader. What? I'm killing multiple of you. What? Roy, use journey map. Roy must follow the rats, the rats, the rats, the rats. Oh, I didn't realize how long health I was. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Roy must follow uh -oh. the rats, the Hendrick! rats, the rats. Hendrick! Hendrick, help! Thank you! Since you use tortilla chips, you use your salsa, whether it's made with corn with wheat, you're eating fruit salad with fruit chip. I don't think that's quite how it works, but... I choose to believe that Roy didn't find a drinking fountain, and they found a whole water feature they're drinking out of by dunking their head in. See, that's exactly where my mind went, too, honestly. Like a parched camel to... <laughs> <laughs> he used to their drinking out of it for, like, an hour. <laughs> yeah. No, that's what I meant, Dust. You know, uh, do not drink out of mysterious fountains. That could be a fate trap. Reality can be whatever I want. He's, he's almost done. Oh, for fuck's sake! You can lead a water to Roy, but you can't wait. You can lead a Roy to Ow! Water, but you cannot make him follow his rat tribe. Things are bad! Thanks, Hendrick. Not really my problem at the moment. You invented the forest of the Nightmare King, Roy. That wasn't a fountain. That was your romance partner from the Baron. What the fuck are you talking about? Holy shit, high beans. Where did you come from? He's playing. Salem, you say not to climb the stairs in the middle of the woods because it's a fate trap when all I want to do is get on the next floor of the tiny woods. Uh oh. Better the Nightmare King than the oh! Nowhere King. Can y'all hear him? And we're dead. 
He's so happy. Beans I'm instant not transmissions in. <sighs> so I'm taking that as you guys can hear him. I already see the quick trip. I am not lost. This is just a 1.3 mile wander. Also, yes, we can hear beans. Good. He's happy as a clam. We were almost all about that Why don't you try the other sword? Because I notice even though you hit twice, it's weaker. Because, like, here's the thing. Get the better sword. Okay, right, but, like... Do, Just try it. No, but, like, do math for a minute, right? This I is, just did. Okay, this is plus five. Is it plus three? That's worse. So it's five more attack. The amount of extra damage one hit would have to do... No, like, it's not going to be more. 1.3 miles isn't that far. Is there anything up this way? Like, any extra items or something? Beans is so happy right now. What a good boy. He's like, yes, let's kill Jasper. Please. I think he's just happy I'm holding him after I was gone all day. Yeah. Because <laughs> normally, he also doesn't really like being held. But he'll kind of grumble and then I'll let him go. But he's burned. You a happy boy? Yeah, I really don't have a lot of better options than just hope we don't get fucking ganged up on again. Is it one of those fights if you, instead of focusing on the shadow, you just kill the thing as quick as you can? Not really, because he'll buff him and then just kill us. Loud boy. Not too loud, right? <laughs> what? I think it's time to set him down now. That fight. wasn't a growl. He's talking. What? What's up? I had to wrangle Ripley into a sweater earlier. She was nakey. Hmm. Oh? You see, now okay. everything's time to put him down. Now everything is bad. Oh, it's because Pepper's right there. <laughs> Holy shit. Pixels are kicking. Yeah, so am I. What? What? Beans is honking at all the cats. Hey, can you keep doing that, Hendrick, please? Yeah, the, the shadow will, will buff him, so leaving it alone is kind of a bad idea. And if they both get pepped up, they can just kill us like they did last time. That's quite a reaction. Eat territory them. and all that. <laughs> Eat them. Roy is territorial? You're just wanting that? Roger, <laughs> please. Yeah, yeah, that's kind of why I don't like this this whole trope. Imagine if this was if this was imagine if this was just the whole game, because there are, there are whole games, whole Dragon Quest games that are like this. Mm. Missile knows firsthand. I'm particularly food territorial. I guess by how much you talk about uh, whole forts. Mm. Rabbits are incredibly territorial. Fun fact. Mm. 
That's just an obsession. A <laughs> pulled pork obsession. I guess there's worse obsessions now. Mm. Which is funny because you know it's not intimidating, bunnies. Yeah, well, I think that's they—they they know that. That's the whole thing, you know. They have to be territorial because the only thing lower than them on the food chain is grass. So like, they can't really let other people in on their turf. I mean, he sat near me once and I scooted my candy closer to my body on impulse. That's really funny. Something makes it funnier when we see is how they're playing to them as much and murder each other and I have territorial rage. Oh shit. That was lucky. I'm now in quick trip. What do y'all want? Big cup. Yeah, right. Damn. I already ate one. I asked you if you wanted like the big bag of them instead, and you said no. Can you get me a milkshake? No, milkshake would go hard. Right now. We do have a blender and ice cream. True. Hendrick isn't good at a healing. No, large it... slushy. Mix up the flavors. He's 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 doing his best. Okay. Oh my god. Holy shit. Jesus. We do have crit right up, both of them we're just using a sword and when our pep power is up, so. That's awesome. That's awesome, yeah. Pissed. I'm the worst. What? After this, I want to cook steak. Like, I mean, I it. just ate through $30 of steak in my Just attack him. Oh, because then we're gonna die and we have to do all this again. Beanie. No, like this is this is a fight we are like always this close to losing. Please no. Hendrick, please. That works. Oh, please tell me this counts. Please tell me, Corbear. Oh, thank God, Hendrick. Oh, you beautiful bastard. <laughs> You're still fighting this guy? I decided to go to Quick Trip. It was a good idea and got ice cream. <laughs> what kind of ice cream? A more important question. Were we in your, in your, I almost said in your head. Were we in your earbuds? <laughs> were we in your head this whole time? Oh, no, because he probably would have heard me die to this guy if I was the case. Oh, that's fair. Blue Moon. Decent. Bunch of fucking weirdos. Lumen's not bad, like the one time I tried it. It was it's definitely okay. very different. It's weird. I'm not saying weird in a bad way, it's just weird. Did you get less lost than Roy's trip? <laughs> oh, that air is so cold coming from outside. So nice. Mm. Die already, please. Crit. We got a few more crits. Lights. Sorry, I just Considering quick trips to block away from my house? No. Oh boy, our crit rate's up. Giddy ass! Sorry. Oh my god, Salem! <laughs> <laughs> Map. Sorry. I really don't feel them coming. It's just suddenly I'm like, oh no, is this vomit or burp? <laughs> Let's go. And you're just ready to puke all over our setup? Yeah. You're the worst. Like, genuinely. I mean, I'm not nauseous, so. Yeah. Crit. <laughs> burp. <laughs> that was the most burp sounding burp. Ever. So, like, you barked. <laughs> burp. I am really grossed myself out. I have just God, I want steak, like raw. What is wrong with me? God, he's almost dead, please. Poey. Hendrick, come on. Fuck. How about you, <laughs> How about you pep on these nuts? Got a dog in them. <laughs> I was like the other 
day in the car. I was like, sorry, I stimmed. And then you were like, how about you stim on these nuts? I did, I did say that. <laughs> it made me lose my mind. It was so funny. Ow. How about you stim on these nuts? <laughs> it's insane. Yeah, but, yeah, but that's why it's funny. Uh, my lungs hurt from screaming. I get really scream giggly with these spinning rides, and that's why I like. Mm -hmm. That's part of the reason I don't like going to those. <laughs> with you. Oh, because I'm loud? No, not, not fucking. Fidget spinners on your nuts? Not because of you, but because you like all the weird, insane rides, and I'm like, nope, never going even anywhere near that. I'm set. I just like to spin. He just t posed for that. He's always done that. Oh my god, Hendrick. Are you gonna kiss him on the mouth live on camera? <laughs> $10,000? God damn. Um, I love that money. I love that money. What the fuck was that? <laughs> I was gonna. I don't know. I'm tired. I'm sorry. I'm still brain dead. Wow, we, we don't. We can't afford shit. I can't lie to you. What's up? Stole the inheritance of the corpse. Good. I sold all his bone marrow. That's what gave me the gold. Yeah, would you look at that? Oh, rib. We got the purple orb back. Mmm. That he was using as an eye. Eye. That, that was, was an AI. Uh, I love refrigerators. Love refrigerators. Energy. <laughs> this does actually nothing for us. Not yet. Not yet. We gotta enrich them balls somehow, I'm sure. What? Well, orbs. Like, I'm sure... Well, the orbs still have their power. Well, so they have power, but then we're going to have to do some sort of hinga dinga doogan ritual, and then we'll hinga dinga doogan, and then we'll get our light back in our hand, and then Hendrick will be like, oh, yeah? And the then we'll go hey, do Salem. the thing. <laughs> stop, stop trying to describe things. No. In and out of pizza, I end up with five donuts. How? To the last bastion and see what, if anything, remains. Didn't like the brands they had. Fair enough, I guess. I trusted you, Roy. Hey. Obsidian brought a friend. I love friend. how Roy's like, what do you want? And did not get remotely even close to anything we said. Didn't even get what he wanted. Went in there with a mission and left incorrectly. <laughs> Share donut? Okay, but they're cream and custard filled. Those are the best. Oh, yeah, uh, you know what? I don't sure. Can we just? Yeah, yeah. Fuck this. We don't need to ride the damn horse. Cream filled, immaculate. Hmm. Unless it's like Boston cream, I don't like that. I mean, like the frosting cream stuff. I like Boston cream. It's okay. And we've lost the haunts again. It's fine. How many horses are we gonna go through? Man. Each minor story arc, are we gonna lose and gain a horse? Boston cream donuts are the best. They're mid at best. So something's... They're too goopy. So something's going on. Everyone appears to be, uh, gone. Also, why the fuck are they called Boston cream donuts? Because they're probably, like, like invented Like, who in, in Boston, Boston cream donuts? <laughs> I have two monster chips and donuts. It's okay, Salem. I Someone. forgive your wrong opinion. Anyone? Well, everyone died. Your Majesty... Calling them cream donuts is crazy. Say cream pie like a warrior. What? Somebody. Wait. That noise. A weird dog is back. Kendra just fucking cuts her right now. She would be so cute if her eyes were spaced correctly. from Boston because I'm going to make you gunshot. I refuse, you fool. It's the sound of the dog. I kind of wish they actually sang this. Yeah, I was going to say, this would, be, this would have been a nice time for the voice acting to kick in. You 
did it, Hendrik. You saved us all. Raise your voices, they sang silently. Aw. I wanna hug that man. Out of my way, Normally I'd make a joke, like, what the fuck, we helped too, but he unironically ate, like, a thousand points worth of damage and got the last hit, and I'm just gonna let Hendrik have this one. Yeah, we can kiss him on the mouth. Why? Don't we start. We leave our socks off. I know, I know you miss Eric and everything, but, like, please, like, don't jump on the Eric. first man. <laughs> How many slimes do you think Hendrik kills that hair, Joe? <laughs> at least 40. And fought to bring back the light. Eric is mid at best. Fuck you. Your opinion's wrong. Jesus, Salem, what? Still in a What's state? wrong with 40 slimes? I think it's, I think it's that, the, you, like, I miss we Eric. Have <laughs> we have the luminary. Dude, he's great. He's like the, the coolest character in this entire fucking all. game. Hendrik. My ever faithful knight. Today's victory is as much yours as anyone's. Your Insane take. What do you mean? Listen, I, I do really like from Eric. Evil. Eric literally I don't was know. in a cell because he stole something or whatever, and then he was the just like, hey, yo, let's break out. And then you. he's the only one with as appropriate reactions to anything, and then he ended up in jail again, that, but this time with Heal Jalaya so or, or Jambalaya or whatever that the is, fucking that thing's is, name is. That is true. Eric you know is the only must. one who, like, who, like, This literally uh, has nothing to do with Asterion. I have a fantasy type. Leave me alone. Luminary. You put some fucking respect on Elijah's name. Eh. Now. Though it cost me my life, I will stand beside you until the darkness is no more. Aww. And we finally actually get Hendrik as a party member. Yay. Kinda wish we had that moment like 20 minutes ago. <coughs> I understand fine. why. So, um, something that I just like, I always, you know, when we play these games, I, I like to point out the, the fan base side of the things. You know, most of the time it's me making jokes about the horrible the shit you'll find on AO3, and we'll get to that when we get to that. Oh god. But, I do actually unironically have to give a shout out to the Dragon Quest fan base just in general, if you go onto like any internet circle talking about this game, no one will refer to Hendrik by name. They all call him eight as reference to the fact that he's the eighth party member and that this is supposed to be a secret. Because if you'll notice, like on that little art that I have, if I pull up the oh, starting yeah, soon screen, you did the fucking... he's not on that. That's true. Not being a creep, but I did look in someone's uncovered window in time to see a PS2 intro. Awesome. But Dude, yeah, when I go... Sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off. Not, not a secret in terms of, like, he's optional, but a secret in terms of, like, you know, it's a plot to, like, oh, shit. Hendrik? That's cool. You know? Um... When I was leaving today, there was somebody in an uncovered window across the street because it's, like, a whole apartment complex, and they were fucking dogging it. That's nice, sweetheart. Yeah. What bean? Be a creep and ask if you want to smoke weed, fill your bellies with diet pop, <laughs> and play Burnout on PS2. You should. You should do that. <coughs> what bean? What? Why are you yelling at me? Do you want to be held again? Is that what you're asking for? What? I love watching people's TVs with them from the bushes. Let me. Let's go talk to the king, and then we can we can wrap up early. Cause I know you're not. Gonna... That is not what he wanted. Okay. No. You called me. Insane. Only if it's burnout three. Yeah, no. I just think that's kind of funny that like the the Dragon Quest fan base is very dedicated to keeping the fact that Hendrik joins you a secret. Mm. Even though I think you called it pretty early, but still. Shit, our, I forgot, are we done yet? Uh, We're no. gonna tell you the same thing we told you, not yesterday, the day before. We, this is an RBG. Jameson had, like, 100 hours on it. We are on, what, 
And when Hour I, 12? When I beat this... Not 12. When I beat this game for the first time, I had, I believe, exactly 89.1 hours on it, according to Steve. There is no shorter sign of a kingdom at peace than a high-spirited populace. Now, to more serious matters. Hendrik, there is something I wish you to have. Aww. The shield of Heliodor. It matches your edgy armor. Which he doesn't I have, have to keep this like meme going, Salem. To I have to and commit to the bit, do you? Duty to prepare his Aww. offspring for the dangers that await them. You will have need of it, I am sure. That's cute. Hmm. You wear it well. The shield has always been the mark of our mightiest knights. There can be none mightier than the Luminary's own guardian. You have no complaints, I trust. No, my liege. I understand that you had hoped for the World Tree to guide you on your quest. Alas. Yeah, so much for that idea. It is no more. But all hope is not lost. Your father once told me that Idrisil was not the only safe place. And we did find a route, Adria. so I'm not too worried. We, we found a route. We got one of the orbs back. Mm. That's a holy something. Mountain in the south, known as Pang Lai. The fate of those who dwell there is deeply intertwined with that of the luminary, or so he said. It may be mere hearsay, a conversation half remembered, but if it is true, you may yet find help in your quest. To defeat the Lord of Shadows. I mean, we got nothing better to go Venture off of. Venture west yeah. through the Mangle Grove, and you will find a valley that leads to the Cost of Alor. Pass through the checkpoint beyond it, and you will soon find Mount Pang Lai. It is not a road I have traveled myself. Be prepared, and may your journey be a safe one. All right. As much as I would love to keep this train a roll and I know you're feeling tired and it's probably a good place as any for us to cut it if that sounds good to you dear yeah okay but f before we do I got one last uh, bit to do Hendrik has a god few... he looks tired in his picture <sighs> what I miss my wife luminary <laughs> um Hendrik has four, five, rather, I can't talk, five options to pick from. We've got swords, like what we have, shields, which is interesting because we don't have a shield tree, axes, great swords, and heralds. Um, I like stick with great swords on Hendrik. I feel like it fits the um, aesthetic, and also we could use the extra damage right now because there's two of us. Uh, great swords. Like Yoshi has been saying this whole time, do some mad fucking damage. Um, we could have been specking into them this whole time. I didn't want to. Uh, parry chance. Yeah, so you want to make sure you unlock this one. Uh, Unbridled Blade, which just does... It does a lot of fucking damage. Our big strategy for a, a while is going to be Hendrik Click's Unbridled Blade. Ah. Um, swords, shields, and axes are all pretty self-explanatory. You know, swords we've seen. Shields is defensive shit. You know, block chance. Blocking spiel, which is a shield smash attack. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, axes have a few of their own little bits. Heroism is a lot of his, like, stat ups and stuff. Um, you might be wondering, like, Jameson, why didn't you, like, just immediately refund all the shit? If you're just going to spec into great swords, because in order to spec into heroism, I need to either go through shields or swords anyway. So we're going to learn block and spiel. So that way later I can go into here. Mid. That also means it's equipment time. Axes are AoE and risk and reward, i.e. miss or crit. Yeah, basically. Um, he's the only character I believe we're going to have axes, which is something. Um, we That's have. sick. Yeah, we can... I mean, fuck it, we can do that. Uh, D9, sure. Heavy armor. Yep. This is that uh, pendant he had as a kid. Mm. He increases his HP and his charm. We don't have money to take the antifreeze earrings, I suppose. 
Um, and unfortunately, we cannot change him back into his uh, his armor. We're stuck with this. Mm. Which isn't bad, and he looks comfy. Kind of hate the mustard yellow, like, turtleneck he's wearing it, under that. It balances out the purple, though. Normally, I fucking hate yellow, but it really balances the whole outfit. Yeah. Yeah, we're, we're certainly a pair of winners, eh, boys? But, we're gonna, we're gonna... Nothing like two bros and a couple of great swords. Damn right. But yeah, we're gonna call it for tonight. We will hopefully see you tomorrow. Uh, thank you, everybody, for coming by and vibing with us. We appreciate it. Thank you again to uh, Chaos for all the subs. Yes, Appreciate thank you, you my, my friend. But until next time, boys, all y'all have yourselves a good day, good night, good whatever the fuck. And we'll see you when we see you. Later, Gators.